Good morning, you guys. It's Wednesday morning, and welcome to daily challenge video number three. So for your math challenge today, you're going to be taking data and then graphing that data. Now you have two choices and it's gonna depend on where you live. So what I would like you to do is pick a window in your house and take a seat there. And for at least an hour, I want you to watch out the window and graph the things that you see. You can either graph animals or types of cars. Now, you don't have to do all one hour at the same time. You can take breaks. You can do some in the morning, some in the afternoon. It's totally up to you and what you have time for today. But I actually did this challenge yesterday because I wanted to see how it would work, what it would look like, and I will show you what mine looks like in just a minute. Now, I chose to just sit, look out my back window for one hour. I put some music on that I could listen to while I was watching out my window. And here's what mine looks like. So while looking out my window, I just wrote down the animals that I saw while I was looking out my back window for that hour, and then I wrote a tally mark every time I saw one. Now, when I was all done and after my hour was up, I graphed the number of animals that I saw. All right, so your ELA challenge for the day is just to read out loud. You could be reading Humphrey out loud, you could be reading any book in your house out loud. Just read out loud today. It could be to a parent, to a younger brother or sister, even to a pet. But what I want you to do is just practice your reading out loud skills. Remember all of our fluency practice. We work on our pace. We focus on saying the words correctly. We focus on grouping groups of words together and making sure that we stop at punctuation marks. All right, so yesterday I was cleaning my house and I found something that I absolutely love that I have not used in a very long time. And this made me think that our bonus challenge today should be to look around your house, look around your bedroom, and try to find something that you haven't used in a long time and use it. It could be a toy, it could be any craft supplies, it could be, you know, for indoor or outdoor, it doesn't really matter. But find something that you haven't used in a while and play with it because sometimes it feels like a whole new toy just to play with something that you haven't played with in so long. So what I found was my violin. Now I started playing the violin when I was in fourth grade and I absolutely loved it. I played it all the time when I was younger and I would love to start playing it again. When I grew up and I went away to college and I started my first job, I didn't have a whole lot of time for, for hobbies and a whole lot of time for playing it. So I kind of just, kept it away and I haven't played it a whole lot since. So when I was cleaning and I found this, I got really excited. Um, so it's something that I'm going to be, you know, working on, practicing again. Um, and so I hope that you can find something that you enjoy that you haven't played with or used in a long time. Thank you for watching Daily Challenge number three. As always, be safe, have fun, and listen to your parents.